Show up at the Martyr to you, Franklin. I'm Alex. And I'm Mitch. In this episode of the Sabre Roar, we'll be giving away some Shamrock Shakes, announcing uproar winners, and finding out what really happens here in the Sabre Roar. In the spirit of St. Patrick's Day, I've been embellishing my Irish heritage. Alec, you're Serbian, not Irish. You don't even have an accent before today. I'm trying to be festive on this holiday, lad. Anyways, the Sabre Roar was also getting into the spirit of St. Paddy's Day by surprising eight lucky students with Shamrock Shakes. Hey, FHS. Want to get lucky this St. Patrick's Day? The Sabre Roar is playing a little game to get you out of the winter blues and into the holiday spirit. We snuck around to a few classrooms throughout the day planting four leaf clovers underneath the desks of a few lucky students. To get you guys all in the spirit of St. Patrick's Day, we're going to do something special for this class. So one person in this hour has a shamrock hidden under the desk. Everyone reach under your desk and whoever gets the shamrock wins. We drove to McDonald's, ordered our 10 shamrock shakes, and got ready to go deliver them to the lucky winners. I am so excited. Thank you. I get a shamrock shake. I really wanted one too the other day. Happy St. Patrick's Day from the Saber Roar. Congratulations to all the students who got lucky. Speaking of luck, I found some lucky charms under the desk. The food of my people. For the last time, Alec, you're not Irish, and lucky charms are not the food of the Irish. Kiss my Blarney stone. After we lost our potatoes, we had nothing else to eat. Speaking of luck, here are some more uproar winners. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. It's time for the uproar already. Okay. With daylight savings coming around, you may notice that it's a little harder to get up, and it's still dark out at 7 in the morning. Well, that shouldn't stop us from recognizing people who deserve uproars. This week's winners are Nicole Barrett's and Lana Shower. Congratulations, you two. Keep doing good things. Congrats to the uproar winners. Alec, you need to stop messing around with a silly Irish accent. You know what happens when you fool around on the saber roar. Every Tuesday, you watch the same roar. You see the drop, the comedy, the hard-hitting news. But what you don't see is what goes on inside. I've decided we're taping the show tomorrow. And if you're not ready, well, you'll know where you'll be going. No, don't make me listen to my voice over here. No, 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 get off me. No, get down there. <laughs> Voice over one. That's two hours. For a DJ and allows them to socialize. Lots of socializing, just like flag football. Winning the spirits there. And lots of socializing. The dance included food. The dance included dancing. Oh my god, I forgot my voiceover. Did I hear voiceover? I have plenty to spare. Five dollars each.
story. <laughs> Welcome to the Saber Roar. I'm Robbie. And I'm Cassie. That wasn't a joke. Please call for help. Well, that's all the time that we have for this week. Tune in next time when we get to know Mr. Doucette better and we get two brand new hosts. What do you think that's that means? Hey, what are you doing?